Hello everyone, welcome to Gulti.com. This is Lokesh Bandi. So today we have you know the cast and uh, director of uh, Duta web series which is coming up on Amazon Prime. Uh, good to meet you, Chai sir. Hi Prachi, hi, hi Parvati Garu, hi, hi. Priya Bhavan Shankar and hi Vikram sir. Hi. Sir, first of all, looking at all of you, I would like to ask you know, and the casting ki fit out undane ilanam this ko lagta you know Chai is from Telugu, she's from uh, Malayalam, she's from Tamil, she's from you know Mumbai, you know. Hindi. Yeah. So, because you want to reach Pan India, reach course, me casting this era, are they really fitting the bill? Uh, Listen, they were so, uh, purely cast for the roles. They were cast not, but it so happened that they are from. So we uh, we would take that as well. But primarily, they were cast purely for uh, for the for the roles. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So before coming back to I'll ask Chai, hmm? uh, sir, and uh, at at one point of time, you know, so many people were asking so many stars, when are you making OTT debut, honey? But because I I want to ask you, uh, why are you making OTT debut? You hmm. already have a big theatrical market. You are already reaching out to so many audiences. You know, your films. Your next film is also being made a pan India film. But why do you want to do OTT at this point of time? Why not? Okay. I mean, why not? And uh, uh, okay, actor ki of course uh, theatrical release wala ok reach was the, but uh, OTT space lo unte goda, the reach is phenomenal. Uh, Manaki uh, 200 plus territories countries lo uh, e series ni release shape of yeah. multiple languages. And me ke del sumir goda uh, foreign countries ninchi OTT uh, course, web yeah. series choose naru, Korean, French, any kind of language. So at the same time, if we goda ak travel out uh, you know, where countries ninchi. Uh, Duta choose that ane. I am not attempt this okay. And moving forward, uh, I think uh, theater and OTT. Then it ki a space equal ga they will both coexist okay. uh, without looking down or looking up on each other. I think uh, audience is very clear. Ilanti cinema ite me mo theater ke liye choose thamo. Ilanti cinema ite OTT lo choose thamo. So they are very clear. So I I don't see why I should not exist in both spaces. Okay, then if I could read between the lines, is it like you are giving you know some shock factor with this series? Read between the nothing. Otherwise, you would, you would have made this uh, film also. No, ante this is not something that you can typically make as a film. Ante a okay. film ko a certain structure onto the your certain screenplay style, yeah. songs, fights, a two to and a far length lo a kada cheppari. But tu ta ne kada a two and a half hours lo chepple mui kada. We need okay. that three hundred minutes plus and. Uh, at, at, uh, song situations and uh, action si situations and cinema lo or theater lo either they expect just that or alanti space lay the do that key so I it's I don't think it can ever be made into a film okay yeah sir Vikram sir actually you know if, if it comes to writing process you know writing a film is easier compared to writing you know an episodic structure like every yeah. episode should have cliffhanger you know the yeah. plot twist and everything yeah. why do you choose to take this you know toughest part uh, it is a challenge, and I have seen so many shows. I love those shows, uh, and in long form, long form, I want to put one to to check myself. Well, am I good in this? Am I good at writing this? Okay. So Allah, I wanted to take it up as a challenge. It was difficult. I have to tell you, it is really difficult. But I think we pulled it off, and it was primarily to see: Am I good enough? Am I good enough for the longer format? Allah, I wanted to put something, put my foot in there, and and give my presence at at the longer format. So, but given that you know you have delivered something like Manam, where the screenplay really made you know huge impact, definitely there are a lot of expectations on Duta also. Yeah. The kind of screenplay you know which you are going to come up with. So how is it like? It's like uh, I, what uh, could you expect from the web series? Is it like a uh, lot of twists and turns, lot uh, of surprises, uh, paced very well. So it's uh, I think one of the biggest challenges of writing the longer format is how we're going to pace it because the duration is lot. So you. Fatigue can set in for your audience if you're not pacing it right. So I think getting your pacing right uh, and uh, rest assured, I think we've pulled it off. I think we've made a good series. I think we've paced it well. Uh, and uh, as a screenplay, I've given it my best. Uh, and I, I, I thoroughly enjoyed the show when we, when we were making it and when we were uh, editing it. And I think so will the audience for sure. So this is a pure like Telugu series only, dubbed into other languages. Yes. It? Yes. Telugu series. So. Yes. So yeah, Telugu series. I'm, I'm actually looking for that moment, not just me, you know, many from the Telugu fraternity, the Telugu states people, because uh, series from coming from Mumbai or from, from Delhi or from Tamil, they already made, you know, huge splash on the OTT market. But mm. Telugu Ninchi Oka series could put work impact creation series. Mm. Mm. I hope um, you guys, you know, will be doing that. 
So then uh, I'll come to Parvati. Uh, nice meeting you. Then see what took you so long to come to uh, Telugu film industry. I've been seeing you films like Charlie and all your phenomenal. Definitely, you know, you might have got so many offers. Yes, but what yes. took you so long to come here? It wasn't an active decision to not come. You know that I did not want to. I did actually. From the time I started, I have been coming for aud either auditions or listening to narrations or. But one reason or the other, either it must have been the character or the screenplay or the dates didn't work out or something. It was just genuinely just not completely out of my control or their control. And then at some point, you know, they say, you know, you let go of something that you really, really want so bad, you don't be so clingy, it'll come to you. What has to come to you? Maybe I had to be at this age with this maturity and all of this to do this character. Okay. Maybe it was, some things are just written like that, I think. So. so, going by the trailer, actually, I don't understand, you know, anyone is paired with you. Hmm? So, there are, there are three of us. Oh. <laughs> no, nobody, I, nobody is paired with anybody. Anyone. Yeah, I think it's <laughs> a... No. Yeah, it's a... It's a very, it's a binary we don't want to go with anymore in life, you know, the pairing of it. We are triples, quadruples. <laughs> <laughs> so, Prachi, let me come oh, yeah. to you, you know, uh, I'm, I'm like, I'm your admirer, like, you know, you, you are very beautiful and you're a good you. work since rock on, I, I can Thank say. Thank you so much. But you also never, you know, forayed into Telugu cinema, yes. you've not done anything here. Yes. Like, why, why, why it took you so long? Um, honestly, I don't think I have a very good reason for that. Uh, there were some uh, wonderful offers uh, post Rock On, but like Parvati said, I think I felt like I was. Um, uh, I, it was too early on in my career. I was 19 at the time, so I I, I wasn't confident enough to kind of foray into uh, a different language. So I think because of that, I did not uh, give it a shot. I didn't attempt and. Um, Maybe this is how it was meant to be, you know, I, I also had to mature so much and then at this juncture in my career feel like, you know, maybe this is the right kind of a challenge to take up because you get comfortable in a zone or in a language or uh, in what you're doing. And uh, then I think there comes a point where you feel like this is the right time to grow. And yeah. of course with OTT, I think all of us, um, we are living in a very, very good time where it's great for writers, for actors, for all of us. So, uh, doing a series was always on my mind. I never thought that it would be a Telugu series before a Hindi uh, series. And um, I think it's exciting because it's uh, Amazon's first Telugu original. It's my first ever venture with this amazing team. And I thought it's just the right one. Yeah. Oh, actually, Amazon made so many Telugu originals, but this is, I think, the uh, first best Telugu original. <laughs> I mean, yeah, with you know, bringing together worlds uh, like this, because true, true. I think... Uh, Somewhere at the back of Vikram's mind, he, he did have this uh, intent of bringing all of us together from different languages uh, to make sure that, you know, the people who are familiar with us get, a, um, get an inroad into this show. Because, of course, we watch shows in a lot of different languages. Okay. But when you bring people together, there's all the more reason to kind of start off with, uh, you know, with that. So, yeah. Cool. So Priya, actually, you know, we met already during your previous Telugu film times, if you could okay. remember. So this is your second, you know, big project in Telugu, if I could say. So I think you were doing another one also. Yeah. So uh, how did it all happen for you, you know, ending up in this uh, beautiful cast? Um, I think I should give it to the director. As he said, I'm glad he uh, envisioned me in this particular character, and I'm I'm glad I'm cast for the part it is. Yes. And yes, Vikram approached me. He gave me a briefing. He shared the screenplay. He gave me a detailed narration. It was a lot of phone call <laughs> sessions during <laughs> lockdown. I think we were, we were connected on call for so many long hours discussing the script and all that. And yes, he's one of the directors I I would love to work with even more and I didn't want to miss out on the opportunity with such a beautiful cast and uh, my personal favorite is Parvati so <laughs> I'm stop that. Yes. She's like right now everyone's personal favorite. No, not right I, now. Yeah. In the Chai is also everyone's <laughs> Forever. personal favorite. I told you previously also like every Star Heroes fan will be like obviously if you ask him who else is your favorite then you will say your name. I told you back then also. <laughs> You're being very sweet, my dear. Shall we celebrate? <laughs> no, sir, uh, uh, let me ask you this, you know, see, if you're putting, all these are already happening stars on the screen as well, silver screen as well, you know, Prachi is busy there, Chai is a very busy actor, Parvati is too busy and even uh, Priya also. Yeah. 
but still you know ott space has some particular actors who just belong to the ott always you see most of the time 90% of them only an ott yeah. are they not you know these stars eating away into their market <laughs> 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 you got these people. It's not a mathematics I want to get on board with. For this particular show, I needed uh, them as a cast. I could not have cast with anyone else. And uh, so I can only speak about, for me, about this show. Okay. And I could not have done it without them. And I had to get them on board. And uh, it took me a, 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 a lot of convincing also to get all of them on board. And I'm glad that they all came. Not, nothing to do yeah, with the Arlis. I also want to add something <laughs> to this. Yeah. I feel like the market, understanding of market and the definition for a long time has been in such a, such a way. We have proof that this works and that works. Eventually, it will all have to sort of be demolished and a new way of looking at it has to come as the economy grows and up and down and all of that. And now the OTT was just, we didn't see this coming. You know, we were very set with the certain, you know, distribution, exhibition, all of that. And then when OTT came, it opened up so many windows for actors, for sure, but also for, you know, people who are making, product, productions especially. So market-wise, I feel even for actors, the more open we are with our um, approach towards market, the better. And I think we share market now than owning one particular, this piece is yours, this piece is mine. I think it's time that it just sort of integrates. And then our, our, our mutual um, strengths will then empower the content. Then, true, true. you know, that you, and I've always been a big fan coming from Malayalam, especially the story is always the hero. And then all of us will come in and just have our parts to play. And I hope that that understanding of market shifts in a massive way. No, having said that, I have to appreciate, you know, Chai Sarvai awesome. because, you know, you were the first, you know, big star who has taken up OTT from Telugu. That way, you know, I have to appreciate you. But, uh, see, my next question would be like, if you are like films, you are limited in certain aspects, like, you know, censorship is there, in content versus limited, okay, in OTT you have no barrier. But as an actor, do you have any, like, such barriers, you know, on the silver screen that you have broken them now here and exhibited something? See, uh, ante me previous question gurinchi maatladalante me taking up ott big star small star ala em ledu i feel as an actor andarki oka journey untadi okay. there is no right or wrong uh, you know we are all artists over here and creative ga what inspires us at that point of time i think that is the path we follow okay. and uh, there is no rule uh, you know on how to play this game it's uh, each one's inspiration like someone's inspired by something and they go with it and I think that's what makes every artist unique in their own way. Uh, boundary structures, of course, you can do a audience theatre, and at the same time, producer work X amount of budget, and invest in cinema, there is a minimum expectation yeah. in terms of entertainment. Uh, format expect chest, or one day, part expect chest, or one entertainment expect chest, or if it's a family film or whatever. So, uh, theater coach it up the audience, our expectation to Oster, uh, while trailer juice in Tarvata, and you can tell double that the time these coni theater goes now. But I think with OTT, uh, our expectations coni marute, uh, okay. work a neutral <coughs> space ninchi, our content ni consume just the So, as actors also, I feel for me, this is how I look at it. It's Naku, work a alter ego, I can try things that I maybe I'm not brave enough to try for the theater. I can try it in the OTT space. Okay. So as an actor, I can balance it with a lot and that is my approach to it. Okay. And will it be like this? Will you continue to help you with a lot of work? No, it's continue to continue the journey. Okay. Uh, you have to balance it with Of course, uh, you know, feature films will always be there. And if uh, you have an interesting character, if you have an interesting character, if you have a very unique character, if you try it on screen, those are the kind of things I want to do in the OTT space. Yeah, okay. Also, I would like to say something. Uh, the, the positive here is OTT content, it doesn't mm -hmm. require a star to give that kind of reach to the content. It just needs performers. Yeah. That, that's and something I would like to cool, say. I, I, I think, you know, honestly, all of us have so much to say here. I think it's a very interesting topic that you kind of touched yeah. upon. But I don't have time, we, actually. I'm sure. No, no, we have all the time. Oh, but yeah. I'll, I'll tell you... I'm ready. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'd, I'd actually like to say that um, there are two very beautiful things here. One is um, we did not have this means or an option before. You know, it was always 
television and it was films. films. And there was a, a very big line between the two, always. Yeah. And all of a sudden there came this, uh, you know, this great swoosh of, uh, you know, OTT platforms. And initially it was just one or two platforms. And we were still figuring out where we are at in terms of that. And then there were plenty. And the best part about that is, you know, writers who probably uh, did not get a chance to showcase their work in films or directors also. Yeah. They, maybe the stories they wanted to tell, they were not right for, uh, you know, film at the time because uh, there's a certain format that they follow. All of them got a chance to kind of uh, take a shot at OTT. And here again, you know, this is the kind of story that Vikram had in mind for years. But he knew that he wasn't going to make a two-hour movie uh, on this. But when the right time um, was there, he knew that, oh my god, I can actually make a series out of it. And uh, he's already done two films with Chai and, I mean, we've never worked before. It would, it would be so unfortunate that if he never made this show, we probably, I don't know when in the future we're working, but at least in the last year, all of us would have not got to work yeah. with uh, each other. So I just think that even in terms of opportunity, um, I would hate, absolutely hate to think that uh, we are eating out of somebody's plate. I, I, I honestly mean it because I've done television, I've done films, mm. I've done it all. Um, I would hate to think that we are taking a piece from someone's plate. Mm. In this case, I actually feel the opposite. I feel like there is enough opportunity for everyone. Okay. And uh, to be honest, uh, it's not that many series that, for example, even I'm doing today, there are OTT stars that are way bigger than us. Mm. And a person like, uh, you know, a stalwart like Manoj Bajpai, I'm, I'm sure you've seen some of his work, yeah, yeah. but he's primarily his from, uh, from the Hindi yeah. Yeah, film industry. He's getting his due today in spite of some fabulous performances in the past, but he's thriving on OTT and he's loving and enjoying doing that even more than um, uh, the film, I mean, you know, the theatrical space. Yeah. So I would say that it's just a great time where I think that there is great opportunity for everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Good. So now that you know, five more minutes will take. I don't know. One last question for him. A quick one, if it is. Otherwise, we have to wrap. I have two questions to ask. One, please. No, we'll go with two. With one for Vikram and one for Chay. Quick one, please. In two minutes, we have to wrap. Okay. Unfortunately, so now that you are, are we rolling? Yeah. Okay. So now that we are talking, you know, you understood how you know it is tough to become a journalist and post questions. Now that you play journalist, <laughs> you know, inside the series, so did you, uh, like, viewpoint or perspective on journalist change or you studied someone in uh, real life, you know, to play the role? What are your thoughts on that? I'm studying you right now. <laughs> <laughs> so part two. <laughs> of course, see the time limit, you know, that, that hunting will be there, the chase will be there. Still, you need to put your best question out there. Yeah. It is satisfy the bosses, satisfy the audience, yeah, and satisfy you as well. Yeah. <laughs> No, it was definitely a uh, journalist character first time play this, no? so it was quite an insightful experience. While uh, life, yana kala, while while process inti, while while choose a kasta inti, adanta tells quote on jargindi, and it was uh, it was it was very insightful for me and Chabal as an actor. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Cool, yeah. sir. Vikram sir, you know I've been uh, uh, hearing a lot about cinematography of Mikey, you know, mm -hmm. because I have people like who work with him, and I know. There's a lot of bounce and diffuse lighting for this, you know, project especially. So, can you tell me something about the cinematography part? Because, you know, for any OTT series, people say content is important. At the same time, the presentation is most important thing. And you always got great cinematographers to do the job. So, why do you got, you know, Mikey on board? Or what is the kind of cinematography you have delivered this time? Uh, Mikey, uh, I, I collaborated with Mikey on uh, Gang Leader. He was, he was my yeah. operator in Gang Leader. And during that time, I knew he was brilliant. So this is, I think, his first, his uh, independent work. And uh, so why Mikey is primarily because of his eye. I, he's got a beautiful eye. How he sees the world is very beautiful, one. Mm -hmm. Two, it was the element of rain that we needed to capture as well. So mm -hmm. that, that played a huge, uh, so lighting up with rain and uh, uh, indoor, outdoor, everything with rain there, we needed someone who has his skill set also. Plus, being an operative, his, he handles the camera very well. Uh, so the handling was, is almost like butter on, on yeah. uh, I saw on, those on muscles. The, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's a heavy camera. Heavy camera. So <laughs> it, all of that. And he's lit, he's shown them all so beautiful. Apart from that, I think even the fear factor that we needed to bring in for a 
for the genre itself. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think Mikey is excel. I think he's one of the best cinematic referees I've ever worked with. Uh, looking forward to collaborating with him in the future as well. And you're going to see it in every frame. You're going to see Mikey shine in every frame. Okay, yeah. sir. My personal is don't collaborate with him again because you, you brought Kuba already. <laughs> Kuba got busy with Pushpa and Pushpa. No, you get another cinematographer, they'll be busy here. So, thank you, sir. Nice thank talking you. to you, Chai, sir. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. So, that's all for the now, guys, from Dhuta Team and me. Keep connected to Gulte.com. And please watch Dhuta web series on Amazon Prime. Thank you. Hi, guys. This is Janvi Kapoor, and you're watching me on Gulte.com. Hi, guys. Nenu Meer Rakul and Meer Chustanaru, Gulte.com. Hi guys, it's me Rashi Khanna and you're watching me on Gulte.com And you're watching us on Gulte. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. Only love to you.